Come on, get up, Anne! 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 Sprig? You're alive! Oh, thank goodness. Ah. Marcy caught me just in time! Can you walk? Marcy? I have to admit, even I'm surprised. Somehow you've still got the gift, kid. Which means... I can't let you live. <laughs> what? Please work, please work, please work! No! Me and Crime will hold him! Just go! <laughs> Quick! Into the portal, everyone! Hurry! The box! Marcy, hurry! I just need to... Now look what you've made me do. Uh, I'm sorry for everything. Marcy! We're through here. Yeah, no! Where will you go? I'll go stay with someone who isn't a liar. I don't know, maybe Loggle? He seems like a street shooter. And wait, let me at least explain. What I did wasn't right, but I didn't do it to trick you. <sighs> Sprig and Polly's parents. Pop, pop. That wasn't your fault. It was a few years ago. I was on a journey when the Herons attacked Wartwood. Sprig and Polly survived, but their parents weren't so lucky. If I'd just been there, I know things would have been different. Ever since then, I swore I'd never let my family down again, that I'd do anything to protect them. So when I found out the box was dangerous, I lied to you and hid it away. I thought I was protecting my family. But now I realize how foolish it was. You're my family, too. And I've let you down. I let us all down. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just so sorry. Huh? Hop up. I forgive you.